Welcome to College Santis. We miss seeing your smiling faces and wish that you could join us. We know that's not possible at this time, so we're going to do a virtual tour in our petting farm. Come and join us as we meet some of our friends. So I am inside with the turtles right now. We are with the red-eared slider turtles. Now you guys might recognize these because you've seen them outside. We live in Ontario and so do these guys. They might be in your ditches or your creeks or your ponds. So they like to live in water. But the one that I'm going to show you today, his name is Mikey. He's an African spur thigh tortoise. And he was actually donated to us by someone who could no longer take care of him. And that's because he is enormous. So let's jump in the other habitat and see what Mikey's up to. This is Mikey. So he lives on the land. He's a tortoise. He's not a turtle who likes to go into the water and take a little swim. He likes to live on the sand. So you'll notice that we have a basking area with a couple heat lamps because they need that spot where they can warm up if they're feeling a little chilly or just spend the afternoon catching some rays. All right, so perfect timing. Mikey's lunch has arrived. Brianna has prepared a feast here for our tortoise friend. So tell us, what do we have? So here we have some romaine lettuce with carrots on top and some green beans. Now, you might notice it looks like we put some shredded cheese on top, but it's actually calcium powder. Does your mom and dad ever tell you to make sure that you drink all of your milk? Because it keeps your bones and your teeth nice and healthy? Well, that's what this calcium powder is. So when our friend here goes into the sun, the calcium is absorbed into his body and it's keeping him nice, strong, and healthy. Okay, so what do we have here? So here we have some fed up apples and strawberries for Mikey as a treat. Our fruit has a lot of sugar in it. And Mikey can't have too much sugar because it's not good for him. So this today is gonna to be a treat because you're here. Our friends get to see him have one of his favorite foods. Mikey doesn't have his water ball right next to him. His water's here, but he prefers to get most of his hydration from vegetables. So out in the wild, there's leafy plants, which are full of water, and that helps keep him hydrated. Here, we have vegetables that are gonna help keep him nice and full. Okay, so it is bath time. Once in a while, we give our friend Mikey a bath of all the season. We talked about how he doesn't drink a lot of water. Well, this is another way that he can stay hydrated and absorb that water into his body. So this is Dustin. He's another one of our petting farm team members. And I had a couple questions for you about soaking. So the water that we're using, is it warm? Is it cold water? So we use lukewarm water. That way it's not too cold for him since he's used to the uh, hot temperatures. Right, which makes sense, right? So it's from the desert. It needs to stay nice and warm. Thank you for joining us down on the farm. We hope you had a good time and that you learned something today. And we hope to see you soon. If you'd like to see more videos like this, like us below and leave a comment. Thank you so much, guys, and have a great day.